thank you again to all of the amazing speakers and panelists for giving their time to share their experiences and insights with us. I hope that you all are inspired to keep pushing for progress in XR accessibility as we are. So what's next? Tomorrow, we'll be reconvening right here to dive deep into the future of XR accessibility. We'll kick off with a showcase of the amazing project that our Business Cases for XR Accessibility Workstream has been working on for the past year. And we'll assemble into our own deep dive groups to get to work on turning principles into, into practice across a number of different topics. Deep dive groups will have in-depth guided conversations on topics ranging from immersive captions, accessible online learning, inclusive hackathons, and funding opportunities to research, policy, ethics, and equity in XR spaces. Deep dives and breakouts at past XR Access Symposia have led directly to new, new collaborations, new projects, and impactful new results for our communities. So we're really excited to see what comes out of those this year. And we hope that if you have a great experience in a deep dive, or if you meet some future collaborators or have an amazing idea, that you'll bring that into your own work or your own advocacy, or even lead an XR Access Workstream project of your own. But the work doesn't end tomorrow. As we've mentioned earlier today, there are lots of ways for you and your organizations to help move XR accessibility forward, whether that's through participating in a work stream, donating, or becoming a member. There's still lots of work to be done, and we can't do it without your help. I'd like to wrap up today first with a thank you to all of our speakers, moderators, and panelists, to our sponsors, Yahoo, Cornell Tech, and the Partnership on Employment and Accessible Technology, to our supporters, Verizon and Google, and to everyone who has worked so hard on pulling together this fantastic event. And finally, to everyone who joined us today, thank you. And we hope that you'll each build on the questions, solutions, and calls to action that you've heard today to make XR more accessible for all.